Home. Two Fort Worth firefighters remain in the hospital this midday, more than 24 hours after their truck flipped on the way to a call. Our Chris Sadek is live with the latest on the firefighters' injuries and the crash investigation. Good morning, Chris. Good morning, Shara, and we're still waiting on an update today here at JPS where two of those four firefighters are still being treated. The other two were checked out and are back at home. We also know that an investigation into what caused this crash is underway. The last words we got from Fort Worth Fire Department came from Chief Jim Davis yesterday afternoon. He said all four were veteran firefighters who were familiar with that road and route. The firefighter in the front passenger seat suffered the most serious injuries. The last update was that they were in critical condition but stable. The injuries the four of them suffered range from simple strains to fractures to a head injury. The chief said some good Samaritans in the area stopped to help the firefighters who were trapped inside the overturned fire engine. But right now there's no evidence it flipped trying to avoid hitting someone on their way to a fire call. I have no indication and no, no speculation at all that somebody pulled out in front of them or that they were trying to avoid anybody. Yes, we thank, we, we ask people, we beg people when you see lights, sirens, noise that you pull, pull to the right. And the chief said that they will cooperate fully with that investigation into the crash cause, but right now their priority is supporting the families of those firefighters. Bashar, back to you. Okay, Chris, appreciate that update. 11.02 on the clock. If you're headed out for